Okay, so let's try this again. Uh, this is the third time I recorded this today, folks, and um, uh, working with a webcam has been um, an adventure. Um, instead of taping this uh, on my bike because I got my grandkids here today, I'm um, take, taping it um, uh, from my room here uh, just to make sure that I stay consistent. I did another five miles today down the road towards Charlotte. Um, getting close to a third of the way uh, out of town uh, between here and there and very excited and happy to do that. I did not bike on um, Sunday or um, Saturday. Uh, Saturday was just really, really busy and I don't ever um, bike or work or do anything remotely like that on Sunday. Sunday's my day of rest. So, um, but I've been having a great old time and today I want to talk a little bit about Southern culture because um, I'm from Southern California originally and we came out here from Washington State where we've been for the last 28 years and um, the pace and everything about this area is so much different than what we're used to. Um, but the people here are marvelous, just a lot of fun, um, very sweet, kind, um, hard workers, but really laid back and it's interesting uh, that combination. Uh, there's not this frenetic urgency like you see in the big cities. There's not um, uh, kind of the abruptness and rudeness that you find a lot um, in the um, larger areas. It's just uh, a lot calmer and um, people are just very um, sweet and kind, very welcoming. The whole thing about Southern hospitality is not a lie. They're just um, very open and um, ready to just kind of take you in and whatnot, and um, as long as you don't act too much like a Yankee, you know. <laughs> but um, uh, my friends out here have been really wonderful, and I've learned a few things. Uh, for instance, I remember the first time I went into Walmart and was offered a buggy. Now, I thought that a buggy was something you hitched to a horse, but evidently it's a shopping cart. And um, well, the first time I heard someone say, oh, I'm going to carry my kids to school, I thought that was kind of odd um, that maybe she should probably just put them in her car, which is exactly what she was doing. <laughs> um, uh, and um, you have to be careful about how you offer someone a cracker out here because cracker evidently is not a very... Um, good word used in polite society um, out here in the South. But um, other than that, um, just having a lot of fun and enjoying the South and all that it has to offer. Um, tomorrow we'll talk about um, what a Tar Heel is. And if you don't know, um, well, you'll find out because I thought that was an interesting thing. That There were a lot of people out here very proud to be Tar Heels. And it didn't sound like something to get so excited about until I read read up about it. So we'll talk about that tomorrow. The important thing is this. Um, get out there and move. Don't quit. I won't quit on you if you won't quit on me. Let's just get out there and every day do something to make ourselves healthier, happier, and do something nice every day for somebody else. And um, so this is the web woman signing out and we will see you next time on our grand adventure here as we move farther out um, to the point where we can start heading west. So, see you all then. Bye-bye.